Word to your mother, uh, time to play a bit of True Crime New York City. Um, a game I've previously played when I was a naughty boy with my Xbox and had it modded and downloaded it, played it for about 10 minutes and thought what a load of shit. Um, well yes, I remember playing the first game, uh, True Crime Streets of LA a bit. Um, wasn't great. Um, but it was an alternative to uh, GTA, that's for sure. I remember you could go around like patting people down and putting them in handcuffs and finding, you know, you'd go around patting people down to like find money or fucking weapons or whatever. It wasn't the best game in the world, but certainly an interesting title and uh, it was worth a, a playthrough. I think this version just tried to go a bit ghetto and uh, yeah, we'll see if it eventually actually fucking loads. Doesn't sound promising from the PS2 but here we go, we're making progress. And look here we have the golden compass for the PS2. Of course these games here will all be played at some point along with all of my other PS2 games. All 160 something of them. I indeed I actually have two copies of the Golden Compass. Oh yes, this game was released in 2005 it says on the back. Uh, as you can see it's taking ages to load. And it just looks like the kind of game you'd buy just from looking at the uh, the back. And it's got some ghetto music that needs to shut the fuck up. This sounded offensive to my ears. Checking memory card. I hate these memory cards. You always, every time I put a game in I go through this bloody saga of memory cards. And they'll just fill it with A's. Old school classic move. Fill your name with A's. Could be worse, could fill your name with AIDS. Just saying. And for some reason, when I press the shoulder buttons, well, any button, it makes noises while it's saving. That's bizarre. I wonder if ever they're supposed to be like hydraulic pump noises from a low rider. Or has the recording actually crashed? No. It's still doing it. <coughs> card out, pull them both out. God damn you bitch, I reset your ass. Might as well give a disc a wipe. There are a few marks on it but nothing um, that you would think would stop you actually playing the game so we'll try again minus the bloody memory cards. If you're wondering what I'm drinking, it's some cloudy lemonade. Ah. Yes, I know there's no memory cards in there because I just took them out. So, skipping through everything, trying to get back to where we were and then proceed to act to woolly play the game. Yes, I like wasting people's lives with pointless minutes of video. That is just what I'd do. Come on, you piece of crap. Uh, this is my first video I've recorded, or I'm in the process of recording today, and so far it's going diabolically.
Well, at least you can turn the PlayStation sign around. Yeah, look at me, I'm a rebel. You probably can't actually see that because it's so small the window of video. It looks so much sleeker having no memory cards. The, uh, turn the motherfucker music down. Yeah. And love, yeah. Um, turn this fucking shit down. Um, is it the goddamn game that's crashing or is it the goddamn capture device? I don't bloody know. Ah, there we go, there's some freaking progress. Um, so, guessing. What? Now the fucking music's all distorted. Try stop and record again. Uh, no, we're gonna have to abandon this one. Um, it's just fucked. Shut up! Yeah, the disc isn't in that bad a condition, but uh, I just can't play that one. So just uh, it's. I don't remember ever getting into it. Um, it for me, the first game, um, and for what I remember of New York City, um, both of the games were just games that just tried too hard. Um, and kind of a, a GTA game style game where you played as the good guy. I don't know, it, it doesn't really work in the same way as being able to just you know, being rewarded for just being a bad guy. 